Thank you for selecting this video and allowing me to help you in understanding various important facts about civil engineering in Australia. This video will be helpful to both domestic and international individuals. Who is seeking employment or planning a career as a civil engineer in Australia? I am going to start this video from very basic, which is by telling you what is civil engineering in Australia. You might skip this part, but then do not blame me when a professor in your first semester would ask you this basic question, and you would not be able to answer this properly, which is weird to hear, but there are a lot of students who are not able to define it. But no worries, I am here to help you so we can define civil engineering as a profession in which you design, plan, and organize the construction of civil engineering projects such as dams, bridges, airports, and other structures. They also analyze the behavior and durability of materials used in the construction and that of soil and rock when placed under pressure by proposed structures and then design the foundations accordingly. They also study architectural drawings and specifications to estimate the detailed cost of the given project. One of the first things we search about a profession is their pay scale, that is how many dollars they earn. So that we can get an idea whether in the future we would be able to buy a mansion with a swimming pool in the back or we gotta live in the basement of some old man. So let's start by talking about it first, and it should be noted that salary will vary from location to location and from individual to individual employers. So as a civil engineer in Australia, you can earn from $56,000 up to $108,000 per year, which could be considered their base salary, not including a bonus or any other thing, because as I said, it varies from company to company, so I will not complicate it. Now let's also talk about their weekly wages, that is how many dollars you could potentially earn in a week. So a civil engineer in Australia, you can earn up to 1,962 Australian dollars per week, on average. Earnings during the initial stage of your career tend to be lower and increases as you gain experience. Now let's talk about the industries in which civil engineers are employed in Australia and their percentage share. 42.9% of the civil engineers are employed in scientific and technical service industry, 27.5% of the civil engineers are employed in construction industry, 13.4% of the civil engineers are employed public administration and safety sector, 4.3% of the civil engineers are employed in transport, postal and warehousing, and rest are scattered in other industries. Here are some of the screenshots of the latest jobs that were posted online, which can be taken as examples. Now let's talk about how civil engineers are distributed in Australia based on state-wise. This data will be helpful for you to decide which state could offer you better opportunities as a civil engineer in Australia. The majority of civil engineers, which is about one-third of them, are employed in NSW. In VIC, QLD, and WA about 24%, 22.2%, and 12.3% of civil engineers are employed respectively. For the rest of the states, I am not mentioning it because they are a small numbers and I do not want to extend this video. Now let's talk about the average number of hours a full-time civil engineer works in Australia per week. They work about 46 hours per week, which is two hours higher than the average as compared to that of other professions, which is 44 hours. The number of individuals working full-time in this profession is about 90%, while the rest are working on a part-time basis. Now let's compare the data of employment based on their education qualification. This data will be helpful for you to decide how much you should study and how it will impact in finding a job as a civil engineer in Australia. 64.7% of the employed civil engineers have a bachelor's degree and about 20.9% of them have studied at a postgraduate level. About 5.8% of them have an undergraduate advanced diploma and got employed as civil engineers in Australia. From the data told above, we can say that having a bachelor's degree could be considered as a basic entry point to work as a civil engineer in Australia because students with diplomas and certificates at the undergraduate level do not get better job opportunities 
as compared to those with higher educational qualification. Remember that gaining higher educational qualifications also means spending more money and time on it, meaning, be very careful about it. As for someone who is rich, for them, postgraduate level educational qualification could be a good option, but for someone who is not rich, living on hand to mouth basis, undergraduate level educational qualification could be a good starting option. Now, let's also talk about gender distribution in this profession. 88% of the employees in this profession are male, and the rest 12% is female. The number of civil engineers in the year 2020 was 67,000 in. It is expected to increase to 77,100 in 2025. Now let's talk about whether to work as a civil engineer in Australia, you need some kind of license, or not. Some of the states and territories may require you to be registered, while for others, you might not need it to work as a civil engineer in Australia. Better to be registered for a safer side, because, who knows about the future, whether there will be new rules, or you may find better opportunities somewhere else where registration is required. The following skills and knowledge are usually required in this occupation. You should have management, analysis, communication, and creative expression skills. The knowledge about engineering and technology, law and public safety, and mathematics and science is usually required. Now let's talk about some of the colleges that offer you programs related to civil engineering in Australia. Those are University of Melbourne, University of Sydney, University of Queensland, University of New South Wales, and University of Western Australia. The average fees for civil engineering in Australia could be considered from 20,000 to 30,000 Australian dollar per year. If you watched this video till here and have any queries about civil engineering in Australia or want me to make a video on any other topic, please comment down below and I would love to make a video on it. It would be very much appreciated if you like the video and subscribe to this channel. Thank you for watching the video and I will see you next time with more videos.